Hello everyone and welcome back to Ocarina of Time, Episode 9. We are carrying the Prissy Princess around the guts of a whale. And now you're all caught up. No further elaboration needed. Yo. You gotta be careful there, friend. You gotta hit me. Ow. Alright. I think we just opened up this. Now I get some free gold skull dollars. Lovely. Perfect. Mine all mine. Now we can continue onward. Oh no. Hey look, you still on. I'm gonna throw you up there. That's it. That's what I've been looking for. Throw me up there, onto the platform. And... good riddance. <laughs> Princess Rudo got the spiritual stone, but why Princess Rudo? Oh my goodness, I finally found my mother's stone. I got very upset when Lord Dabu Drop and swallowed it. While I was feeding him, he suddenly swallowed me. I was so surprised I dropped it inside. But now that I've found it, I don't need to be in here anymore. So, take me home right now. Okay. Oh, thank God. She's dead now. Yeah, uh, what is this? An octopus? Oh no. Oh no. Hiya. Will you turn around because I stunned you? Nope. Ow. Ah, you're gonna make the snow in, aren't you? Oh god! Navi target! What is wrong with you, you stupid fairy? Do you are half stupid? Go bum slice. Bum slice too. The re bum slice me. There we go. Just gotta get him while he's spinning around. Nope. Why did that not hit? Alrighty, turn around. Right as there we go. Player one defeated. Good so far. Yucky. This is what Pinocchio had to do.
Whoa. Goodness. Also, that sound it made. Oh. When it landed, I'm pretty sure that's the same sound they used for the doors falling in the bell tower in Madrid's mask. So I think that's pretty cool. When he goes assets that they ended up reusing. Man, my trigger's mask is so awesome. I love Zelda. This is just a good game series. Oh. Wow. More useful than the Zora Princess. Because at least the box doesn't yell at me. Found ya. Or you found me. We found each other. It's quite romantic. Can I kill the jellyfish? Because I don't want no one trying to pee on me. I know what they say about them jellyfish, right? If the jellyfish sings you, suddenly I don't want to pee on you for some reason. You destroyed a gold skull toy. You got a token for me to destroy it. Get out of here, you depraved sicko. You disgusting jellyfish creature. I spit in your general direction. Bioelectric and Amone, Berenade. Did you bring the Berenade for the stakes? It's, it's supposed to be marinade. Oh, my, my apologies. I hope you guys just love how good I am at every accent somehow. I, I don't know how I do it either. But like French accents, Canadian accents, I, I got them all. Joe, Joe, why are there jars inside of you? Jars presumably full of hearts. Many parasitic jellyfish swarm around this monster, aiming for his body protected by a jellyfish. Yeah, that's not really working out for me right now for some reason. Ow! Am I supposed to just be killing the jellyfish, or am I supposed to attack it when it's down? I feel like I want to kill the jellyfish. Ow. There we go. Now we're getting some hits in. Now we're getting our licks in. Oh god, don't lick it. Ah uh, yes, the original guardian. Is this a zona parasite? Yeah, 
I am. This is like the most anticlimactic boss fight so far. All the other ones had like cool epic intros and this one was just kinda here. The door didn't even look like a boss door, we just walked in and there was a boss. Heart. You got a heart container. My gotta make things so heart containing. Hey you I totally don't remember your name. You, you're late. What took you so long? You're useless. I was just lonely, that's all. Just a little. Alright, cool. You're the Sundere Zora. But Baka, it's not like I was worried about you or anything. No one likes that. No one wants to hear you do that. I'm just gonna drown myself now because I'm so sick of you. You, you looked cool. Cooler than I thought you would anyway. Just a little. Well, anyway, you saved me, so I guess I'll reward you. What do you wish? Just tell me. I want the spiritual stone. You know, I'm gonna do nothing really. Nothing really. Hehe, <laughs> don't be shy. I can tell what you're thinking. My mother gave it to me and said I should give it only to the man who will be my husband. You might call it the Zora's engagement ring. Alright. I'll give you my most precious possession. Zora's sapphire. Alright, bye. See you later. I don't know why she swam away from me. Does the water just get a lot more blue? You obtained the Zora's Sapphire! This is a spiritual stone water pass on by the Zoras! The most precious possession. You don't know what she's talking about. But you finally collected all three spiritual stones! Go back to see Princess Zelda. Don't you tell my father. Where am I going? I think this is a fairy key over here. Let's go to the fairy key. Oh, was I wrong? I thought there was a fairy key. Whoa! It was not the rock that blew up. Okay. What up? What? Why did it double click the... That's why these controls are always so finicky when you have a control, uh, control stick instead of the actual buttons. Because the game is built to be played with buttons. I wish I knew how to hook up my 3DS to be recorded. Would've been fun to play the 3DS version. Welcome to I am the Great Fairy of Magic. I will give you a magic spell. Please take it. <laughs> magic spells, that would have to be for Roar's Wind, right? You have Froze Wind. This is warp magic. You can use Z warp when you are in danger. You'll teleport to the warp point when you first use the magic. You'll create a warp point. When you use the magic again, you can either dispel the warp point you created last time or warp to that point. Have you said warp or point enough yet? Remember, you can use Froze Wind only in dungeons that have the dungeon map hidden inside, okay? When the battle has made you weary, please come back to see me. Okay. Thank you. Bye bye. Do 
Hi, King. I performed unlicensed surgery on your god. Uh, blew a giant hole in the wall over there. Oh, and I'm engaged to your daughter now. Have a good day. I'm sure he was happy hearing all of that. I'm sure I just made his day. Before we activate all this stuff, I want to stop by Kakariko. Can I boomerang heart pieces? Oh, I missed. I had to see with my big fat head in the way. I can boomerang. Huh. Instead of coming right to me, it just dropped on the ground. Neat. Anyway, here we go. Uh, the king's ass and ball of water, full of rupees for some reason. They help get rid of the chunkiness. Oh boy. I am gonna be so rich. Stop by Kakuko. Oh no, skeletons! Please keep the skeletons, guys. It's okay. I know, I know you were all scared. It's okay, guys. Don't worry. I know it's October, but yeesh, we don't need that kind of scariness around here. No, 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 sir. That sounds like a spitter, man. Tell me I should get this and not continue the main quest, because I agree. You destroyed a gold skull, huh? Yeah, I'm looking for me to destroy it. Perfect. Yeah, to break the box. I did not like it. Hello, Monsieur Dampe. Hope you are well, sir. That was weird. Oh! Oh, oh. Tickled my tushy. Now we're so fast. So fast. And I want to go talk to the Spider Man's. Spider Man's. Uh, the Spider Curse in their hands. Living hell all the time. I can't think of a good rhyme. Spitters. 
Oh, it looks like you're all Spidermans. I say I like that because all those like AI voices people started using on YouTube. And whenever they try to write Spider-Man, like the superhero, it always comes out like Spider-Man. And it makes me laugh. Oh, made me walk out of the house again. All right. And then it is the attempt. We can go to the field. Do, 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 do. Oh, I did not mean to do that. You tried to adjust my camera angle. I've been playing so much Elden Ring lately. Oh no. Okay, let's avoid the castle gates to the best of our ability. We got our bunny hood. Shut up, Navi. We did see that the mailman would appear around here, but closer to nightfall. Kind of a cloudy day. You know what? Yeah, what? Let's just get the cutscene over with because the episode's over. almost over. And then we can finish up whatever we want to do in the next episode. Oh no, it's suddenly so dark. I thought I'd just play the sun song so it would be morning. But there are dark clouds over Hyrule. Now we just need a beaming ray of light from the forest. Oh boy, lightning. So we're in A today, huh? Why are the gates closed? Princess, could you open the gates for me? I want to buy more masks. Oh, thank you, princess. Very kind of you. Oh, are you here to deliver the mask directly? Been a while since- Oh, you almost ran me over. Okay. Just like, stupid peasant. Take this! Oh, he's aiming for his head. I have the worst aim. Hey, sorry about the princess. I hope you're okay, man. I just wanted to stop you. Like, I was chasing her down because I was worried she would do something like this, and then, like, I'm just so sorry, man. Hey, don't worry about it. I, I get it. No, no, no. You see, royalty doesn't... They can't just treat people like that, and I'm gonna I'm gonna find her and give her a good talking to, and just hopefully this whole mess will be sorted out. I'm, I'm so sorry about what's happened. Alright, did you, did you see which way she went? Just let me know, man. Ah, uh, Your horse is a literal demon, I think. It has glowing red eyes, and I'm kind of scared to talk to you. Oh, sorry about that, man. Yeah, we're... I mean, yeah, he's a demon, but... Demon doesn't have to be... Meh, eh, I can't even duck. Demon doesn't have to be bad. We just, uh... We're, we're working on, on reforming him, having him be a, a productive member of society. Okay, see this right here, this kind of prejudice, is why we don't normally bring demons into the castle. But I understand, if you're not ready for it yet, you're still young, and I'll, I'll, I'll just, I'll leave you to have a good day. Yeah, I'll, I'll leave you this as a parting gift, a little bit of magic. Kids like magic, right? Oh my god, I'm so sorry. I, I thought you would be able to catch that, I apologize. Alright, I, I, I'm just gonna get out of here before I cause any more trouble.
Have a good day, sir. Again, so sorry. Huh. What a chill dude. Unlike that princess who sent me to a volcano to die. He was a little awkward, though. Just grab the oot. You found the oot. This is the royal family's hidden treasure, which Zelda left behind. She tried to throw it out your head. I pick that one up and I look at Sarius and I just throw it in the water and I'm like, no, don't want it. No, can you hear me? It's me, Zelda. No, when you hold this ocarina in your hand, I won't be around anymore. I wanted to wait for you, but I couldn't delay any longer. I had a really hilarious prank set up for you. You would have had so many broken bones by the end of it. Anyway, here's a song I like. I accidentally flicked the stick. Play the damn song. You've learned the song of time. Leave the smell it here in front of the altar in the Temple of Time. You must protect the Triforce. Alrighty, that's all we have time for in this episode. Thank you all so very much for watching. I hope each and every one of you has a fantastic day. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye bye!